Hi guys, so I decided that today I'm going to make a little bit of a different video than I normally do. Usually my videos are more based around my animals and animals in general. But today I decided I would do a get ready with me while I answer some basic questions about stuff that people might not know about me that people may be wondering. So, there's going to be at least 25 questions. May There may be more depending on how long it takes me to do my makeup. I've already done my hair and everything. So, let's go ahead and get into it. So, the first question would be... Um, my age and everything. I'm just moisturizing my face right now with my proactive oil free moisturizer. It's a little bit dirty. Um, I am 16 and my birthday is January 6, 2004. Um, I am going into the 11th grade and yeah, I'm 16. That's all there really is to say about that. Um, so there's not much to say. I'm just going to finish putting my moisturizer on and then I'll talk a little bit more. Also, in this video, I will be mentioning one of my hands is painted and one isn't. So, excuse that. Got a little bit lazy last night. Um. Also, I feel like the base to every good foundation is a good moisturizer. So... This is also going to be like a little, my daily makeup routine video. So I'm just going to put my hair up. My dog, you're probably going to hear my dog whining in this because she whines when she doesn't get all of the attention. So, Oakley, hey. Okay. So, the next question would be, what are my favorite, like my favorite colors, favorite songs, favorite artists and everything? So, my favorite color is orange, and, um, my favorite book is probably Where the Crawdads Sing, and favorite movie is probably Gran Torino, um, my favorite YouTuber is Laura Lee, or Juicy Jazz, um, so, yeah, favorite song is probably really basic. My dog is right here. Um, but now I'm just going to put primer on. And for my primer, I really like to use the e.l.f. Poreless Putty Primer. So we're going to be putting that on my face to prep my skin. I freaking love this primer. I want the matte one, but I can't find it anywhere. stepdad and my younger sister and my younger brother and the reason I don't live with my dad is because my dad died a few years ago um so yeah it's life and for pets I have a lot of pets I have oh my dog <laughs> I have a chameleon I have a velvet chameleon I have two bearded dragons I have two ball pythons a tiny is a water dragon, three leopard geckos, two crested geckos. That's it. Well, besides my um, my two, we have two beagles. One of them is mine, and it's the white one you just saw. That's Oakley, and the other one is my mom's, and her name is Tink. So that's the dogs. We don't have any cats, sadly. I'm allergic to cats, um, but I really want a cat. Sucks. I rescue cats all the time. I love rescuing animals. It's something that I love doing. Um, it's something that the community and animals in the ecosystem, I guess, benefits from. So, yeah, that's that. I'm going to be doing my foundation. I'm using the Hard Candy Glamouflage Full Coverage Foundation. I really love this stuff. It's so underrated and not enough people talk about it. So, I really recommend this if you're looking for a good affordable drugstore foundation. So I'm just going to put this on. I guess my next question would be like, do I play sports? Oakley! Oakley! What is my dog doing? Anyways, do I play sports or anything? No, I don't play sports, but I used to dance. I used to play soccer. Um, I am an ROTC at my school. So, yeah. That's that. I'm thinking about playing volleyball this year if school isn't canceled again because of the coronavirus, but that's a 
possibility. Um, I'm really considering it. Um, I used to love playing volleyball, but like at my school, it's just like all the popular girls. So, yeah, that's that. Um, I, like I said, I used to dance, and I um, I did ballet, jazz, hip hop, clogging. I did all kinds of stuff. Um, but I've kind of got out of that, I guess. I really would love to do it again, but there's no really good dance academy academies around here. My dog is being really loud. I'm so sorry. There's not really any good dance academies around here, but I, I have been looking just a little bit for a new dance academy since the one that I used to go to was for kids because that was when I was really younger. So that's a maybe for me. Um... I would love to get back in the groove of dancing. I loved dancing. I was really good at it. But, you know, I got older. Um, so, yeah, things change. Um, I live in South Carolina. Where the Carolina Cup Boys is. Um, what else? Oakley, don't mess with that. Jeez. I'm sorry, my dog is like all up in the way. But I guess it's okay because he's cute. As I was saying about my reptiles, I have a lot of reptiles. Um, most of them are rescues. Um, like I said, I do love rescuing animals and I do it all the time. Um, some of the animals I have rescued, it would be, I rescued a cat one time, like not too long ago. It was... Oakley, there was a little kitten in the road, in the middle of the road. We, I think, and well, we have a lot of stray cats around here. Everybody thinks it was a stray cat, but it was in the middle of the road and like in the median. And I didn't really understand it because when I picked it up out in the middle of the road, um, it had like, you could tell it had really bad allergies because its eyes were all nasty and stuff. Um... But he's all better now. He's with my cousin's mom, and he had a little cast. He did break his leg. So what makes me, what, in my opinion, I think what happened is somebody threw him out of a car because that does happen a lot around here. And he broke his leg when he fell from the car and hit the cement. And it's really sad, but he had a little cast because there's no way he made it to the middle there's no way he made it to the middle of the road without um, already getting hit. So, but yeah, he's all better, which is really good. It made me it made me really happy that he is all better now. My dog, she's still being loud. Um, but if you hear her, that's her. People always think I'm crazy for having snakes, but in reality, they're, like, really awesome. I'll insert some pictures of Athena, my big snake that I rescued. She had a respiratory infection, and we took her to the vet. She had to have ten shots, one every three days, and we did that, and she is all better now. But she's fixing to get a new home because I rescue animals, get them back to it, like, in a help, get them healthy again, and then I usually rehome them, home them to somebody that I know will take good care of them. And, yeah, so that's her situation now. Um, so, concealer, I am using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. This, um, I really like this stuff. I love creamy concealers. Um, I guess we can talk about some things I like doing. Um, I love painting. I really love painting. Um, what else? Like... I love makeup. I really love makeup. I love skin care and like taking care of myself. Um, rescuing animals and being around animals and interacting with them. I love that. Um, Oakley. I love, one of the weirdest things that I like doing is organizing stuff. I really like organizing stuff and I don't know why. Um, it's kind of weird, but... I will. 
Also, I have trichotillomania. I guess that's how you say it. I'll put it on the screen somewhere, and you can go look it up. Um, it's why I don't have eyelashes, but you can look that up for yourself. I don't like explaining it. It's something that I've always been insecure. It started about four or five years ago, um, about when I was in like fourth or fifth grade. It may be longer than that, um, but yeah. And I have ADHD. Um, I get really bad migraines, really bad migraines. Um, I guess there's not much to say about my health. I mean, I take care of myself for the most part. So now we're going to move on to setting powder. For setting powder, I think I'm going to use my Cody Airspun setting Oh, Sorry. My Cody Airspun setting powder. I really love this stuff. It is very, very messy though. Um, crap. I honestly think I spill more of it than, I'm, than I use. But oh well. It's like. Now where is my powder brush? Here it is. Um, so I guess I'll tell you all my animals' names, I guess. Um, my chameleon's name is Tiki. Um, my dog, oh my gosh. Um, my, one of my ball pythons, the feisty one, his name is Morty. Um, big ball python that I rescued, her name is Athena. My leopard geckos, we have Mr. Chicken. <clears throat> we have Lemonade and we have Pineapple. For my crested geckos, we have Cheerio and Ellie. <clears throat> For my bearded dragons, we have Piper and Twisty. Um, <clears throat> the Chinese water dragon, I just recently rescued him, so he doesn't have a name yet, so I could really use some name suggestions. Um, and then our dogs is Oakley. Oakley's my dog, the white one that you're hearing right now and that you're, you just saw. And then we have another beagle, her sister, and that is my mom's, and her name is Tink, short for Tinkerbell. Um, yeah. My oldest animal is Piper, my big baby dragon. He's the most four. <clears throat> Actually, no, he's not my oldest animal. My oldest animal is the big ball python. She's around 10 years old. I've only had her for about two. We're going to bronze my face up, and today we're going to be using the LA Colors Bronzer in Beach Babe. I really like this stuff. It's really great. People, I don't see people talking about it as much as we should be. Hey, Oakley. Favorite food is between mango and Mango and um, peaches. I love peaches. Now I'm all bronzed up. Gotta stay hydrated, right? What else? Oh, for blush, I'm using the Physician's Formula Butter Blush. I love this stuff. I love all of the Physicians Formula Butter Collection thing. Um, it smells so good. It smells like coconuts. I love this. Oh, also, I love coconuts. I really love coconuts. Now my lizard's being loud. Okay. Okay. So now I guess we're gonna highlight my face. Um, for highlighter, I'm gonna be using this, the Wet n Wild Fantasy Makers Loose Highlighting Powder. And this is in the shade Sparkgasm. Love this stuff. 
If you haven't tried it, I really recommend it. It's like, oops, so pretty. So I spilled a little bit, so I guess that's what I'm gonna use. I love this stuff. And now we're on the topic of makeup again. Um, my favorite drugstore brand would have to be um, Elf or Wet n Wild. One or the other. Um, I love that highlighter. I love it. I really recommend it to you. I'm not really big on loose highlighters, um, but this one's awesome and I love golden highlighters. So now I'm gonna do contour and for contour I'm using the Wet n Wild Mega Glow Contouring Palette in Deuce de Leche. I guess that's how you say it. It looks like this. I love this stuff. If you haven't tried it, I highly recommend it. It's great. and do my eyebrows for my eyebrows if I can find it I really like out outlining with this elf instant lift brow pencil I love this thing let me grab my mirror from my blush so I can put this on And to fill in my brows, brow pomade, I'm going to be using the e.l.f. brow pomade or brow gel, whatever you want to call it. Let me find my brow pencil. So now my brows are on. Thank God. Why does this brow look so I need to fix that? Jeez, I am awful at doing my eyebrows. It's a little bit better, I guess. So for eyeshadow, I'm going to be using, I'm going to be doing a neutral look. I'm trying to close this. Okay. So for eyeshadow, we're using the, what is this? LA Colors palette. I don't know who with the names or anything, but this is what it looks like. That, and then the Elf Matte for Matte Summer Breeze palette. Let me show you. It's really pretty. So... For my transition color, actually, let me do my eye primer first. I completely forgot about that. If I can find it. I found it. We're using the e.l.f. eyeshadow primer. It's the shade Sheer. If I had to pick a favorite high-end makeup brand, I would probably pick NARS or <clears throat> Clinique or Tarte. I love Tarte. For my transition color, I'm going in the e.l.f. palette and I'm going to be using this color right here. Then we're going to go in with this brown color. Okay. Let me take my other brush. So now I'm just going to go in. Let me look in this palette and see if there's any colors. Actually, yeah. We're going to go in with this color right here.
there's that and then we're going back into the elf palette and i'm gonna grab this color this color right here and then i'm gonna take some of this color this brown color Then I'm going to go back into the LA Colors palette and I'm going to grab a shimmer. So I'm probably going to use this shade right here, this shimmer. This palette isn't my favorite. It was the only palette that I had that was a drugstore for the video that had the same color scheme as what I was doing on my eye. I guess I'm just going to darken it up again because I feel like I lost some of the color with the shadow. So I'm going back in the e.l.f. palette and I'm going to take more of this color right here. Eyeshadow is done. So now I guess we're going to move on to eyeliner. So for the eyeliner, I like using find it. Actually, we're going to darken up the shim shimmer a bit. And we're going to jump into this LA Colors palette. I don't know what palette this is, but it looks like this. And what color do I want to use? I'm probably going to use some of this dark shimmer color. Wipe away some of that fallout. Okay. Same for my eyeliner. I'm using this Elf Liquid Liner. Let me grab my mirror. I don't know why I'm shaking. I'm just gonna outline that and let that dry. Then we'll go back and fill it in. But for now, we can do the lips. And for the lips, I'm going to use the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Instable, I guess. My stomach is talking to the holy gods. There's that. The lip gloss. I'm going to use the e.l.f. Lip Lacquer in the shade Bubbles. There we go. Now I guess I'm just going to go ahead and fill in my eyeliner. I completely quit talking. Oh. Let me fix that. I fixed it a little bit, but we're going to outline. I'm going to fill in the liner. Same thing, using the same thing. done. I'm gonna bring in, actually that might be okay. Eyeliner's never even, but it's okay. So, this right I'm using the Wet n Wild Matte Finish Photo Focus. Crap. That's it, I guess it isn't gonna spray. Maybe I need, maybe it's running out i use it a lot so i hope you enjoyed thank you for watching um don't forget to like and subscribe and i hope y'all have a great day